Hi, I'm Belinda Carley, the Director of the Institute of Personal Care Science and today I'm going to show you a really innovative concept and that is water soluble oils. Now the material I'm going to be showing you today is using Securancy. Now they have three different types. They have a jojoba oil that is water soluble. As you can see, this is the actual raw material here. And you're going to see me drop this straight into water in a minute, so it's really easy to work with. They have a version of this material that also contains squalane. And then they have a version of this material that also contains dimethicone. So you can pick different versions depending on your formulation needs. Now these are the products I'm going to show you how to create today. This one here is a hydrating mist or could also be used as a toner. And this one here you can use as a gel mask base, as a gel serum. Now both of these products contain the Securancy. Now if you use low amounts, it's almost transparent. I've used 10% in this product. So it looks a little milky, but it's still translucent. And as you can see, completely stable. Now I wanna show you just how water soluble it is. So here I have my water ready to go. And I'm just going to add the Securancy to this. And as you can see, it goes straight into the water. It doesn't form a separated layer. Now the reason it does this is the Securancy material is actually water, glycerin, hydrogenated lecithin and the oily substance. And what they've done is they've mixed these items together under a high pressure homogenizing process to form mixed micelles and liposomal structures. And this is great because it means that this material in formulas can actually hold actives, whether they be water soluble or oil soluble within that liposomal structure and then enhance delivery into the skin. So first, let me finish showing you how to create this really cool mist product. And like I say, this could be used as a hydrating mist with the extra oil present, it's gonna give that extra bit of moisture to the skin with no residual greasy feeling at all. And of course, it's completely sprayable. So I've already added the Securancy. Now this is in there at 10%, as you can see, completely water soluble, but that's where we're getting a little bit of that color from. I'm just going to add a hydrosol to this. Now I'm using a hydrosol so that I can get a subtle aroma in the product without needing to use any essential oils or fragrance. Uh, the hydrosol, of course, is completely water soluble. To this, I'm just going to add some extra humectant, and this is just to give extra humectancy to the product so that the skin will be even more hydrated and supple after the mist is applied, and my preservative. Give that a stir. Then I just need to check and adjust the pH. And that's my hydrating mist with my water soluble oil present. Now the great thing about this is I could add all sorts of water soluble actives to this base. They'll go in really easily. Uh, I could pre-mix them with the Securancy to help get enhanced delivery from a water-based product where delivery of actives to deeper layers of the epidermis would normally be a problem, this material will help carry them through. Now I just wanna show you how to incorporate it into the gel formulation. And again, I have my water. I'm just gonna add my hydrosol. Again, I'm making use of the hydrosols. I could solubilize fragrance or essential oil, but I'm making my life really easy using the hydrosols instead and also minimizing the ingredients I need to add to get efficacy from this formula because I'm gonna get that from adding the Securancy which has the jojoba oil present. Now I'm just gonna add that in. Again, you can see it just goes straight in to that water phase, straight away, completely water soluble oil. Now, of course, I can premix uh, some actives in here if I want to get some of that liposomal delivery. In this case, I've just made a very basic formula for you to work from. And then I'm just going to add my xanthan gum in a slurry to help make my gel. Now I am using a really high grade of xanthan gum in this formula. This is Keltrol CGT. As you can see, it's completely transparent. 
So it gels really transparent in the product. It's the securency that gives us this little bit of color. The reason I'm using this material is because then I don't have any tacky residue, but I'm still going to get a very viscous gel, nice silky skin feel, especially because of my water soluble oil that is present. And you can see I get my nice clear gel, a little bit of colour from the Securancy, uh, but completely water soluble oil in this formula. Now I'm just going to add my preservative and check and adjust my pH. And there we go, there is our beautiful gel serum. As you can see, using a material like this, I could add it into any water-based product without a problem. I can add it at the end of an emulsion with my actives already solubilized in that liposomal structure. I can make water-based products that normally wouldn't contain oil. Now they can contain some oil and they're perfectly stable. I don't need to use a solubilizer. I can make the processing nice and simple. I've used a 10% and a 5% loading in these formulas, but you can use more. As you can see, it goes straight into the water phase of a formula and it still has that fantastic mixed micelle and liposomal story to help deliver any actives you might want to include in the formula as well. And of course, containing that small amount of oil in its water soluble base means it's delivering some emolliency and moisturizing benefits in products where it would normally be difficult to include an, an amount of oil that would provide those sort of benefits like your hydrating mist. The applications for this kind of innovation are almost endless. It's a great way of incorporating oils into products where you normally couldn't add it. I was asked how can we get oil into water-based formulas without using a solubilizer and this material is your answer. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please leave any questions or comments below and make sure you subscribe to receive notifications about all our videos where I look forward to keep bringing you these kinds of innovations and formulation solutions. Happy formulating.